These are some symptoms when you need to drain and change your vehicle motor oil. When you first pour the oil into the engine, you might see a bright yellow or amber color. This color fades away and gets darker by all the contaminants inside the engine. So the first sign to replace the oil would be its texture. Remove the dipstick and check the color of the oil. If it's too thick, gritty and dark, it's a good idea to get it changed. You might not know when the texture starts to change so do the dipstick check regularly, once a week or at specific intervals. Some people might misunderstand the term dark in vehicle oil. A dark oil doesn't mean it's time to change. A fresh oil when circulates through the engine and mixes with the old oil, with accumulated carbon and grim, can change its color to darker shade. This can happen immediately or just by running the engine for 5 minutes. To properly identify, rub the oil in between two fingers and check if the oil feels like or has an abrasive texture. Check the consistency as well. The second sign of engine oil being bad is, you may hear unusual whining sounds from the engine. The purpose of engine oil is to provide a thin layer of protective film between the moving parts so they don't touch each other and reduce friction. And when the engine oil starts to wear out, the stability of film or protective layer that reduces friction starts to break out. This causes the metal particles to rub each other with limited lubrication. Also when the oil is too old, it starts to get thick. This can put huge stress on the oil pump which can cause a humming or whining sound from the engine. This sound from the oil pump will be more evident in cold starts and will settle down a bit when the engine becomes hot. Another sign of bad oil in your vehicle is burnt oil smell at higher engine temperatures. As the oil ages and starts to break down, it escapes through piston rings and burns with fuel. Also when it ages it starts to lose its chemical properties and overheats to form vapor. This vapor is consumed by the engine through crankcase ventilation. Either way, you may experience burnt oil smell around the car. Keep an eye on the oil dipstick as when the oil is burnt rapidly, you may see the oil level going down. Oil level may go down because of other reasons as well so be sure to diagnose properly. Another symptom when the oil in your car wears out is you may experience a slight decrease in fuel efficiency. When the oil ages it becomes thick and greasy. This causes the oil to have more resistance to flow and the oil pump needs to work harder in order to lubricate the parts. This puts extra load to the engine and affects the gas mileage slightly. With bad motor oil you may also find some issues with oil pressure light in your dashboard. Oil pressure light is provided by the manufacturer to indicate the driver if he has a good oil pressure running throughout the engine. The light should go off immediately or after a fraction of seconds when the engine is started. If it takes time to go off or comes on intermittently, you have a problem with our lubrication system. Engine oil, when aged, will be thicker and the pump needs extra time to pump it and build pressure but once it's in pressure, holds the property till it's cold. There is another possibility when the oil wears out and cannot provide proper film strength, it loses its pressure. This happens mostly when the engine becomes hot and the oil light comes on intermittently. This can also happen if the oil pump or the there's excess mechanical wear inside the engine. Make sure to diagnose the fault correctly.